So all that time in Asov's care and you couldn't get any intel on the bias? Uh, well, I tried. Asov's a cagey one. Almost never talked <laughs> shop in front of me. I can't imagine why. Hey, he trusted me enough to believe I was an expert in all this hoysala crap. <laughs> hoysala. Yeah, that's it. By the way, thanks for keeping him busy for us. Yeah, you know, I wanted to buy you some time in case these 1800s are not quite modern. <laughs> The soul thinks we're dead. Let's try to keep it that way. So, oh, Nadine. We're not on a first name basis. Okay, fine. I heard you worked for us off, too. How'd, uh, how'd you deal with the torture? Hey, thanks for not murdering Sam, by the way. It might prove useful later. There you go. Good. Positive attitude. Oh. Oh. That was close. You in one piece? Yeah. Go team! Come on. We're exposed up here. You know, I feel so much safer with her around. I never would have found you without her help, okay? Okay. I take it she's going first. Why don't you go ahead? Leave the rope for me. You got it. Next time, bring your own bloody rope. Let's go. I think it's the last of them. Uh, Nadine, love a word. What? Just following your example? Yeah, but... Come on. No way I'm letting anyone from Shoreline get the tusk. That RPG trashed the exit. Maybe, maybe not. Let's go see. <sighs> you all right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, shit! Oh, is that trip really necessary? Okay. Now then. Really to the rail yard. God, ball, she's alive. <laughs> Nadine, she's over here. Well, you all right down there? Yeah, I was fine until Sam made me picture God's balls. Where are you? By the radio tower. Nadine, do you see a way up? I'm afraid that we'll find something you can hook your rope to. Ah, oh, sounds like a plan. Come on up. 
Your turn, Miss Ross. <laughs> Don't call me back. Yeah, well, it's professional courtesy. Well, Look, nearly there. Sam, you can use my rope. Go ahead, he can use mine. Part of the rope club, I'm honored. Let's bring that sucker down. 